Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. I am Shaw. This is a reaction channel. Uh, so I want to watch the parody scary movie again, but in order to do that, I want to watch all the movies that are referenced in that parody. And so I've already watched I Know What You Did Last Summer. It was my first ever reaction video. Now today I want to watch the sequel, I Still Know What You Did Last Summer. I don't know anything about this movie. I didn't even know there was a sequel. So I don't know if it's gonna be any good. I don't know any opinion about it, but we're gonna find out together. So let's just hope it's a good movie. All right. Oh, here's the tiger again. <laughs> now this time I know there's no tiger in it. <laughs> don't worry. I've learned my lesson. Okay, one thing I'm definitely sure is that we're gonna have a bunch of jump scares because the last time it was like jump scares after another jump scare after another jump scare. That's the worst part. I hate that. It wasn't even that scary. It was just jump scare, jump scare, jump scare. I killed a man. <gasps> she actually confessed. Wait, I just realized something. Wasn't she supposed to be dead? She said she survived, but at the end of the at the end of the movie, we had one more jump scare and I thought it was her death scene. I know what you did last summer. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm fine. You sure? Yeah, I don't I'm know fine. that guy. Isn't the guy in um Pretty Little Eye? I'm pretty sure that's this the teacher. I wonder if she's gonna die. Main character, 90s movie. 90s or 2000? I don't know. 90s movie, let's say. Main character, most of the time they survive, I think. But if you're gonna make a sequel, I hope they make it interesting in a way that she dies, for example. Although they didn't do that in Scream, and that was, I think past the third movie, the main character should definitely die at least. I'm definitely okay. Love interest. Thanks for talking. Cool, cool, cool. We got a love that? interest. That's right. cool. He definitely is gonna die, right? Ray. <laughs> Ray. I was gonna say, didn't she say that he survived? He survived. He's in the movie. That means they're gonna come back together for sure. Oh. Buffy. Oh, it's her shadow. <laughs> I thought it was the killer. I was like, already? All right. Time to die, I guess. D There's gonna be a plot twist. It's gonna be like, no, it's just your roommate. Or, no, it's just a cat. Doesn't she have a roommate? She's in college. She definitely. If she ha if she's renting a house, it looks like a house. It doesn't even look like an apartment. If she's renting a house, she definitely has multiple roommates. It's got to be a roommate. Dude, I thought you were out of town. Look, I just wanted to borrow your black skirt, but I'm not ready to die for it. Dude, I thought you were out of Now you know what I want to do to you, right? Right? Huh? No, no. Do we want to know? Do we want to know? So what's up? Want to dance? Say yes. No. No means yes. Don't listen to her. No means no. All right? Let's get this straight. No means no. Fisherman Killer is back. All right. Um, don't even anybody find it a little bit suspect that there's a guy in a full fisherman outfit in the middle of the dance floor? I mean, he's, in, he's on the balcony, but still, there are a lot of people around him. So didn't anybody see him? Then they'd be like, what the fuck is he wearing? 
6.7 radio station. Who am I speaking with? Oh my god, Julian's work in the morning! Oh my well, god. Carla, what are you doing at home on the long 4th of... <laughs> what is your favorite <laughs> scary movie? Okay, uh, B Brazil, um, the capital of Brazil, uh, come on, come on, come on. okay, five seconds, uh, you're in college, are you sure? <laughs> Ooh, what do you I missed that part. Okay, hello? We'll call you back with all the details, so what's your favorite radio station? Imagine you, you mess up. <laughs> you say, Virgin Radio is my favorite. <laughs> All right, so Ray is really still a fisherman. Okay, good for him, I guess. Steady job. Steady paycheck. Hey, hey I'm really glad you called. Sure. I think I know the actor who put the phone on the... Carla just won a trip to the Bahamas. Um, this... Oh, they're going to the Bahamas? That's so cool. Cool. Really? You know, and it would be it would be a great chance for us to just hang out for the week. Yo, I know the actor. Is that the guy from the movie, that weird movie, um Martha, Marcy, May, Ray, something Marcy, Martha, Marcy fuck it. He was like a guru. He was like um a leader of a cult. There was um Elizabeth Olsen in it. And he was older, like way older. And he sang in the movie. He had a pretty good voice. She, she's just a picture. Live, lives on my wall. She, she's just a picture And the reason, reason, reason it is so small Maybe not uh Oh What are you doing? Okay, man? his buddy is definitely gonna die I don't think Ray would die yet I feel like it's a diversion. Like he's not gonna his friend is gonna die. But I think some someone is gonna attack him from behind. Why would you kill the friend? He didn't do anything. The fuck? Are you for real? You're gonna do the same thing as Barry? You're gonna try to outrun a fucking car. I feel like they deserve to die, honestly. You All you had to do is go on the side of the road. There's so many trees. The guy cannot follow you. <laughs> the side of the road. There are too many trees. Okay. Prediction. So they're gonna go to the Bahamas. Is the story in the Bahamas? Okay, so either the story is in the Bahamas during their vacation or they go to the Bahamas and then they come back right away. Maybe. Possibility. If they go to the Bahamas, Ray's not there. So there, at some point he's gonna join for some reason. He's gonna come over there and join Jennifer Love You with because he's not dead. So I don't know why he's not picking up the phone though. Maybe he's hiding, or maybe the killer, or maybe the killer got him but didn't kill him. I don't know. But prediction, if they go to the Bahamas and they stay there for the rest of the movie, I feel like Ray's going to join them at some point. Or the killer and Ray are going to join them. 
Like the killer is gonna bring Ray to the Bahamas? No, that doesn't make any sense. No, 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 okay. Ray is gonna join them in the Bahamas. That's my prediction. So, is there a problem? No. <laughs> no, there is no problem because we are all going to the Bahamas. You got yeah, let's enjoy the Bahamas until, you know, until the fisherman killer starts to fucking kill you with the hook. Yeah, he killed he killed the guy with the with a hook, so it's still going to be it's still going to be the same freaking thing. Why did they make a sequel? It's the same thing. They could have at least changed the weapon. Got to be shit. Oh, no, no, a white guy with dreadlocks. Anything you guys need, Titus got. Is that Jack Black? Is, there anything I can do? Is that his name? Wait, 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 stop. I have to find out. All right, I looked it up. It's Jack Black. <laughs> Why is Jack Black wearing dreadlocks? <laughs> Wait, I also... 30 minutes in! I didn't realize it was Brandy. Wow. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. <laughs> oh, you're in 201 and 202. Is that a bad thing? No, not at all. I'm pretty sure there was a murder in the honeymoon suite. Because the way he looked at the chart, I can tell you right now, he was disturbed. Something horrible happened in one of these rooms. Season? Hmm? It's the 4th of July weekend. Storm season begins today. Clouds roll in like clockwork. What? Storm season? Yes, it's our... That's why they won. Because it's fucking cheap. Nobody wants to be here. Oh my goodness. I knew it was too easy. He said this Willis guy had a hook on his hand and was driving a BMW. <laughs> The guy was like, Don't, stop bullshitting me. He crashed his truck into an old guardrail. He got thrown a hell of a long way down into a ditch and he's dead. So Ray is alive, but he's like in a coma? He'll probably all come back. Oh, that's 100% Ray. Okay. Oh, he's not there anymore. He ran away. Okay. Yeah. So Ray was like in a hospital? Now he's gonna go to the Bahamas for sure, right? Last day of the season, yes, yes, yes he did. Right. So why are you still here? Because it's the last day of the season, so there might still be clients. That's why she's still here. Do you think the employees are gone before the, the last day? What the hell? How do you run... A hotel without employees. Plus, employees stay off-season. It's just less employees. But there are still some employees to take care of the hotel. But, I miss Ray. I really do. You know, I tried to call him. You know what, Julie? Brandy looks fire. Love the outfit. All right, sister. Got that right. You look beautiful. The bartender, I love her hair. Love curly hair. My hair is like so freaking straight. Like it's so straight. No movements so whatsoever. <laughs> At all. So I love curly hair. Just like the bartender is, her hair is fire. Love that. Bouncy, curly, full of volume, which I do not have. Love that. Please give a round of applause for my friend, my very best friend. Get up here. Oh. Julie James! Yeah. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? Nothing. Tomorrow the hell are you going? Tomorrow the hell are you going? Julie! That was weird. That was super weird. So is she hunted? Like, does she have hallucinations or something? Because it's not realistic, obviously. The killer cannot do that without people noticing. I mean, like, she's the only one noticing the thing. So I'm like, so it's in her head, right? 
The killer is real. He's hunting her, but there are extra things that she is it, just like hallucination from her part. Oh no, random guy that we don't know is gonna get killed. Hey man, oh give no. Me a hand, would you? Hook, hook, hook! Ew, 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 no, 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 no! Okay, at least we haven't seen it. We didn't see anything, it's fine. The fucker? Whoa, uh, wait, 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 you took, you took white sheets and you didn't realize they were covered in blood? I mean, you deserve to die, what the hell? Oh yeah, then what's the policy on burning herb? You can't try it until you buy it. Hmm, <laughs> pretty sure he's inside. Let's find out. Where the hell's my toothbrush? What did he do with it? That's the question. Alright, wait. I just gotta say one thing. While I was editing the first movie, I just realized something. At the end, the killer gets his hand cut, and now he and he was a like he was killing with the hook. So he just fully became Captain Hook, because <laughs> he's also a fisherman, right? Captain of his own boat. So Captain Hook is killing again. <laughs> All right, let's see where Captain Hook is. I wonder what's the idea here. Is he just trying to scare her for a while and then eventually killing her? Or is he trying every time to kill her? But he's so not good at this that he can succeed. Oh, what did he do to you? That poor man. This random dude. What did he do to you? I don't understand the killer though. Why is he killing extra people every time? I do not find this at all funny. There, there was a body in there, I swear it. And he had the time to, to clean all the blood? Come on. No, I want off this island. That's not possible. What was that look he gave? You want out? <laughs> so the two black character, main characters are gonna die. Because, you know, they're black. And then wannabe boyfriend aka guy who got friend zone real fast is gonna die right or ray is gonna die and the guy is gonna survive and then he's gonna be the love interest but i feel like he's gonna die friend zone <laughs> y'all grew up good y'all grew up real good you know what jack black is growing on me right now i mean not as much as his plans are growing, but come to Papa. This character is kind of growing. This is kind of, oh, right before he dies. <laughs> Never mind. I feel like they introduced him just to get some killing scenes. Oh, they're all sleeping together. That's so cute. Hey, Julie, you see any dead bodies out there? Any fresh kill? Shut up, Ty. How about, uh, Freddy or, or, or Jason or somebody? It's okay, he doesn't believe me. No, that's his right. I'm starting to think I'm crazy, too. Julie, nobody thinks you're crazy, okay? I mean, Buddy over here thinks you are, though. The greenhouse effect has caused the Gulf Stream to shift, which caused hurricanes, massive coastal flooding. It wouldn't take much of a storm surge to wipe us right off of this island. He just gave us the whole weather forecast. Okay, cool. This is what happens when you're friend zone. You get real interested in weather forecast. Yeah, you're not leaving this island until you get a tan. Come on. Wow. Can oh hell no. Uh uh. Uh uh. Someone is gonna die in it. Someone is gonna die in this thing. Why would they have that in the Bahamas? Don't you have enough? Sun exposure? <laughs> Why would you? Okay, that scene is only to show Jennifer Love you its body. <laughs> what was that camera shot? All right, let me just get that full body. <laughs> mm. 
No. There's no way she dies now. There's no way she dies now. Uh, okay, okay. They're showing both of them because one of them is gonna die. Obviously, it's gonna be Brandy, right? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be like, which one is gonna die? Both are gonna get attacked, but one of them only is gonna die, but no. So he's tormenting them. Willis with our car and then we threw his body in the water to cover it up. Only he didn't die. He killed Barry and Helen last July 4th. But why would the killer kill them? Why wouldn't they just kill Jennifer Love You With and then be on his way? Like, kill Ray, kill Jennifer Love You With and then leave. Why the fuck is he killing all of those people? Come on! Julie, I can't believe you. How can you not tell me the whole story? I'm your best friend! Because she committed a crime, that's why. She got away with murder. Do you really think she would tell you? You're friends, but you're... Come on. That's a whole new level of trust. <laughs> Anyone missing a hair tie? Shh, that's mine. Toothbrush. Voodoo. Voodoo? For what reason? For what reason? What if he's down there collecting body parts or something? Let's just get the fuck out of here, alright? Yeah, yeah, sure. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh shit. Julie? Julie's not gonna die, girl. You're about to die, girl. You should be scared for yourself, not for Julie. America! Brazilia. Oh. I tried to use the radio, but he had already destroyed it. And what's with the voodoo? I stole those things to help you. To protect you. Oh my god. <laughs> Why would you introduce voodoo and then not use it? So then where is he, huh? Where's this Ben Willis guy, huh? I don't know. You never fucking know. I mean, what, are we supposed to just trust you? What if it's the boyfriend? Okay, no, I'm, I think I'm mixing up with Scream. He used to work here at the hotel. Lately, I've seen him out in the woods by the orchard. If you like, I can show you. I feel old. <laughs> Knowing that I was alive when this was filmed, <laughs> seeing the TV thing, <laughs> I'm like, damn, <laughs> I'm old. What's today's date? July 4th. Yeah, seems correct. Seems right. You said you're gonna leave us here by ourselves? It's okay. You couldn't have gone far. I'll catch up with you guys later. Yeah, separate. It's a great idea. That worked really well in Scary Movie before. Hey, hey, you okay? Gonna... She stabs him. <gasps> Plot twist. She's the killer. That would be great, actually. She became insane after the first one to the point like she was tormented of the idea that the killer was still alive. She became insane and then she started killing people. That would be nice. That would be a great sequel. Why can't... Why did he do that? What? What the fuck? Wait, I need to see that scene again. Wait, what happened? Set to the pantry. Right? Why? Is that a good place to hide? I don't know, I'm just fucking hungry. <laughs> Let's go snack. At this point, I mean, if we're gonna die, if we're gonna die, at least die with a full stomach. We're not going anywhere. What? Why? What the? So now you're bad? I mean, he was practicing voodoo on a toothbrush and a fucking air pit, air tie, so I didn't think he was innocent. That's a pantry? Stop trying to act like you ain't hungry. That's a pantry? It looks disgusting for a pantry. What the hell? It's just a stupid rat. Uh... Oh, bartender is still alive. I forgot about her and her gorgeous hair. Gorgeous. 
Love you, boo. I'm rooting for you and your hair. Beautiful hair. Crazy bitch. Hey, you're the one who broke into my hiding place. Oh, I'm sorry. I must have missed the sign. Excuse me, but this place didn't have a murder rate until you people showed up. <laughs> She's got a point. I'm tired, I'm hungry, I'm fucking horny. And personally, I haven't seen one goddamn psycho killer. <laughs> oh, and then he died. Oh, I knew it, I knew it. I knew he was gonna die the minute he said that. I was like, oh, no, don't do that. You jinx, you jinx yourself. I mean, guy, come on. You jinx yourself. You jinx yourself. Now, who the fuck is the killer? Was it the same guy? I, I gotta admit, I'm kind of disappointed by this movie. <laughs> well, he said, I haven't seen a killer, but he's seen a bunch of dead bodies. Like, do you really need to see the, the killer to believe there's murder happening around you? Unless he thinks there are fake dead bodies. <gasps> oh my god. I thought he sliced her foot. I was like, we're done. We're done. Um... Wait, did he slice her or not? Is she okay? Did she just fall? <gasps> oh my god. Just fucking jump at this point. <sighs> See, this is scary. This is scary. When someone is running against you, uh, running towards you, and you're escaping. This is, this is scary for me. The part where, like, you're being chased. This is the actual scary part. The rest of the movie wasn't scary, it was just jump scares. But that, that for me is a good scary movie, just that part. It's too long, it's too long, there's no music. It's for a jump scare, girl. I'm sorry, you're about to die. Yeah, all right. Well, Brandy, see, what's going on? There we go. Well, Brandy, it was nice to see you. Yeah, take care. Well, I mean, maybe she escapes it. I'm not sure. Someone has to die at this point. It could be the bartender. I hope not. I'm rooting for her. But yeah, it could be the bartender dying first and then Brandy. But Brandy is gonna die. What? This is 100% scream. Again, I thought her, her her foot was sliced. Okay, I was wrong. All right. Don't worry, I know there's emergency power somewhere. Wait, I thought I saw a, a dead body. Hold of my hand. Hey, Julie, Carla, just grab a hold of my hand. I am holding your hand. See, this is what I said. Dead body, dead body, dead body, I said it. I said I saw a dead body. Okay, I didn't say that I saw like multiple bodies, but I was still right. You guys okay? Oh, oh friend zone guy. Okay, still alive. Come on, come on. Is it me or he looked? He looked way too okay with the with all those dead bodies. He looked at it and he was like, okay, let's go. We should go inside. Look, the last time I saw the slicker guy was on the beach. I think we're safe, okay? You got hit in the head by the voodoo guy. The fuck? Voodoo guy said, we're not going anywhere. So he's definitely on the island as well. I can't find a wound. Mm. It's not my blood, Julie. Plot twist. Plot twist. He's the killer? He's one of the killer, right? Two killers. What's your favorite radio station, Julie? 
Oh, fuck. Fuck off. Friendzone guy, really? Damn it, I was so wrong. But why? <laughs> That's why you shouldn't friendzone anyone. <laughs> Friend zoning people is dangerous, you know? You could create a killer. Uh... Oh, that's why he fucking hit him with a bat, a baseball bat. He realized he was the killer, right? There are two killers. It's the fir the one in the first movie, and then there's like the friend zone guy. Oh. No, she had gorgeous hair. <laughs> I was rooting for her. That's it, girl. One slice on the arm. That's it. Will Benson? Benson. Hi, Dad. Okay, okay. So, old killer and his son. He had a son? What? It's time to die. Let it go! Let it go. Right at the right moment. You're no killer. That's my job. What? Just shoot him. Really? Performance issue right now? Okay, so he had a son. Okay. What? This is so random. Have we heard about his son in the first movie? I'm so confused. Stand him up. <gasps> the son. Well, you pissed him off now. Yep, you pissed them off. Now the gun works. How many bullets do you need? <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. This is a scary movie. This is an American typical scary movie. So the killer is going to come back. I think... I don't think he's going to come back. But I think the son is going to come back. No? Not at all. Oh, okay. Both are... Okay, cool. Have they talked about the killer's son at all? Did they give us some hint of his existence in the first or in this movie? I don't remember anything. It's so random. Oh, <gasps> she's still... Brandy is alive? Oh my god, I was so wrong. I thought Brandy was gonna die for sure. I mean, her boyfriend is dead, dead. No one's ever going on vacation. Ever again. What does it sound like? It sounds like the music from The Exorcist. Oh, is this gonna be like the last movie? She's gonna have a jump scare at the last minute. Someone is gonna jump on her. I don't understand. Did they explain what happened in the shower? At the last minute of the movie, the first movie, she was attacked. Like she said she, she was a survivor. I don't think she mentioned the last scene from the previous movie. The killer came back to life as a teddy bear. Ah! What? If I should die. What? So, okay, all right. What just happened? Okay, so this was I still know what you did last summer. 
I don't understand how they end the movie every time with her being attacked. Yep. I'm pretty sure she hasn't spoken about it, so I don't know how she survived the attack from the last scene of the first movie. Now she was just attacked in the last scene of the, the this movie, so I don't know if there's a third, but you can't make a, a third movie and not explain, like, what happened in the last scene. Right, okay, so, okay, it was interesting. I was wrong again. I'm pretty good at predicting things. I think I got right some of them, but I, I'm really confused about the, the killer's son. I don't remember them ever mentioning that he had a son, so I feel like it's very random. Like last time, I'm like, it's so random. If you don't talk about it, if you don't set it up in the beginning, then I mean, if they don't, wanna, they don't want us to guess who is the killer, then good job, I guess. It's just a little bit weird. For me, it feels random. I don't remember him at all. Anyway, so that was I Still Know What You Did Last Summer. I definitely prefer the first one. And even for the first one, I still, I gotta say, I've seen Scream. And I gotta say, for me, it's still, Scream is way better than I Know What You Did Last Summer. Probably because it's more aware of being a cliche. Or it's making fun of all the cliche in, mo in our movies, but... Yeah, definitely. For me, it's like Scream is top five in horror movies. Not that I have a top five, but definitely. And I still know what you did last summer was good. It wasn't my favorite. And now this one, I don't know. <laughs> this one was interesting. I think it was kind of cool that they did it in vacation. I don't know if they've ever done a movie, a horror movie that is based in like a, a vacation story. But that was interesting though. Other than that, I think I prefer the first one for sure. The first one was just better quality. And uh, yeah, sequels are hard to make.